100 point challenge today with Robert Sacre of the Los Angeles Lakers, the 7 footer from Gonzaga. Now in real life Sacre is a bench warmer, but in NBA 2K14 he is 7 feet of pure elegance on the court with legendary performances at every turn. Now for Sacre, he's a 62 overall, and he has a 68 close range shot and a 66 medium range shot. So I'm thinking the only baskets he's going to be able to score are standing layups and standing dunks. Now he does have a height advantage over Terrence Jones and Dwight Howard, uh, which are the front court for the Houston Rockets. So, I mean, the standing layups just like that, they're going to be money for Sacre all game. But other than that, I'm not really sure what Sacre can do. In fact, his two highest attributes in the entire game are durability and hustle. Yes, out of every single rating that they give a player, his two highest are durability at 85 and hustle at 82. So I'm trying to score as many points as I can based purely off of Robert Sacre's hustle. He's going to hustle his way to 100 points this game. And so far, he's doing a great job. 18 points. Uh, with 40 seconds to go in the first quarter, but we're losing to the Rockets. And the 100 point challenge is not complete if we lose the game. Now for my lineup, I actually have three point guards uh, playing for most of the game at the same time. And that's a uh, 77 year old Steve Nash, the first point guard. And then Vlade Divac's uh, doppelganger, Kendall Marshall, second point guard. And then I also have Steve Blake playing, uh, although he just did get traded to the Warriors. Uh, I played this game before the trade deadline. Uh, he's on the court along with the two other point guards. And look at the score right now. 29 points for Sakurai, but we're losing by 8 points. But there, oh, come on, Sakurai. Oh, look at Kamen, the offensive rebound. That is the dynamic duo for the Los Angeles Lakers this game. It is the caveman Chris Kamen and the crazy man Robert Sakurai. Now we have 33 points uh, with Sacre, but we're down by 7. We gotta lead this comeback. Sacre 16 for 26 this game. Wes Johnson gets that steal. Sacre gets the bucket. It's a 5 point game. 2 minutes to go in the second quarter. And I'm gonna post up the beard. Go to work. Go to work. He has like a 60 low post offense, but he got it to go and it's a 3 point game. We are coming back. Sacre is gonna hustle his way to 100 points. Another bucket. I'm telling you, the long balls from my point guards to Sacre, they're impressive. And there's the crazy man. Give it to him. There's Sacre. Oh, look at Terrence Jones was going for the block when I didn't even shoot the ball. My opponent's just spamming that block button. And look at the on-ball defense. He's playing the passing lane. Sacre dunk contest. We're down by two now. Sacre is hot on the offensive and defensive ends. And look at quarterback Steve Nash. What a catch. What a catch from Sacre. He had Harden guarding him, and so you know Sacre's elevating on that one. And there's another long ball. The transition game for Sacre is incredible. We have finally taken the lead on the Rockets. And in the second half, he's getting things started with a bank shot, C plus quality. And look at Jordan Hill, another long pass. It's a two on one for Sacre, but he's speeding by and dunking it on Patrick Beverly. Five minutes to go in the third quarter. Here's Sacre leading the fast break. Oh, it's not Magic Johnson. It's Tragic Bronson. He's going in the post. What was that? And he got fouled. That should have been an and one. And with that, my opponent quits as Sacre has 51 points this game. It's another legendary performance in the career of Robert Sacre.